number two's out. Yeah. Yeah. So it's now down between number three and number, number four. four. So sorry about this, guys. I'm going to have to go back. You having three and four again, or just four? I'm going three and four again. So we're going to go three again. It's between three and four now. All right. There you go. It's half a spoon on that. Right, hi everyone, how you doing? Um, <laughs> I'm looking forward to this one. <laughs> We've got Lee here, the Mac Master. He's uh, down in London for a few days. And um, if you watch his channel, you've probably seen that um, there's been a bit of controversy. <laughs> Bean gate. <laughs> yeah, towards baked beans and what's Heinz and what isn't and what's this and what's that. So I've got a little challenge for him. We've got four lots of beans, we've got Heinz, we've got Branston, we've got Aldi, and we've got Lidl. Now, I'm going to blindfold him, and we're going to put them all out in these dishes here, and uh, we're going to get him, get Lee to try them, and see what he says is the best. So that'll put it to rest. Well, I always say Heinz, don't I? You do, yeah. Um... I mean, I prefer Branston, because it's just... Uh, well, I'm not going to go into it because you might you might suss it out when it's in the dish. Right. But I'll say afterwards why I like Branston. But I had Branston on your breakfast. You did. <laughs> do you remember? I do now. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, so we're going to heat them all up. I'm going to put name tags in front of the dishes, um, so you'll see what they are. But Lee won't and he's going to be blindfolded and he's going to try each dish only a spoonful on, on each and we're going to see what happens because I'm really interested to see um, what the outcome is Well, if I, if I don't get hives, I'm going to end up with egg on my face so I'll have a, virtually a full English breakfast <laughs> <laughs> So let's get ready So, I'll just pan around and show you Lee he's got a He's got two bandanas in one, so I'll put one inside another one, so he's proper, uh, he can't see. How many fingers have I got up? Well, I'm imagining one, middle one. <laughs> no, see? <laughs> Nearly though. <laughs> There you go, so beans all heated up now. As I said, Lee can't see the tags, um, only we can. So, just to show you, it's blank on that side, so we're not cheating. So, we've got four spoons. So, I'll give you the first one, and we start, we go to this end, and we call them number one, two, three, and four. So, if I guide your hand into 
the first one. That's the first one. Okay. And then there's just half a spoon there for you. So that's number one. We got some water as well. Yeah. I'll just put your spoon back in there because I'm going to have a clean spoon for each for each one. I'll get some water. Hmm. Oh I think. Hmm. It's not an overly strong taste. Not an overly strong taste in bean. Okay. The sauce. It's got a slight funny tank to it. Interesting. Okay. Okay, well, there's number two. I'll guide you, guide you in. There you go, you got half a spoon there. I'll just put the spoon back in. If you want to come back to any, by the way, you, you're welcome. So that's number two. Mm, that's nice. Yeah? Mmm. That is a... You know, we don't want to drink that. That's... <laughs> Sanitizer. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, number two is nice. Yeah? Hmm. Number two. Yeah, that's nice. Okay. So there's the clean spoon for number three. I'll give you half a spoon. There you go. Put that in there to you actually. So that's number three. Mm. That's the nicest tasting so far. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I might need to come back to number two, but... Okay. It's got between two and three at the moment. So that's number three. That's water, not salad either, isn't it? Yeah, yeah that's water. Clear the old palate. And then, clean spoon number four. I'll just go in, give you half a spoon. There you go. That's number four. I'll take that off you. Yeah. It's gone very quiet. I have. I have. <laughs> I'd like to get. I'd, can I go back to number three? Can you put some on number three for me? Number two or three? Number three, I want to go back to number three. Okay. Right. It's, this is quite interesting. It's already, it's already on there. Okay. So number three again. I'll take that and then put it there. That's a sweeter bean. Yeah? Sweeter sauce, yeah. Okay. All oh, right, now we, I'm sorry it's taking a bit of time this, but it, it, number one's out. Number one's out. Okay. That's gone. Number one's out. Right, let, let me go back to number two. You want number two? Yeah, yeah I want number two. I'm, I'm going to deduct these down. There you go. Number one's out, so that's gone. Number two's out. Yeah? Yeah, so it's now down between number three and, and number, number four. four. So, sorry about this, guys. I'm going to have to go back. You having three and four again, or just four? I'm going three and four again, so we're going to go three again. It's between three and four now. All right, there you go. It's half a spoon on now. That's, that's number three. That's number three. It's nice. Right, I'm going to make a decision here. Number four, then one more. Number four. There you go. It's a nice beam and a nice sauce, but number three is better. So you're saying? Number three. You're saying it's Heinz or you're saying it's the best? I'm saying it's Heinz. Okay. And number. Four. Number, number well, four. I'm not really sure because I'm not a. But it's your second best. 
It's my second best, yeah, but I, I would I would say out of all of them, I would have thought the number three is Heinz. I'm probably going to totally be wrong, on I? But out of them two, three's definitely the nicest tasting bean, and four is the second. They're both tasty, but three's a winner. So I, I would have okay. said, personally, I would have said that that is Heinz, because that is the nicest tasting bean for okay. me. Okay. Well, you can take your blindfold off you've done your taste so in first place then for number you for you is number three number three yeah and second place is number four yeah and the other two you're not going to worry about no I, I didn't like number one no compared to them no so should we turn around and see what they go on yeah so you didn't like number one not keen on number one no well that was little so not a bad yeah, Not a bad yeah judge, it's, had a, it's had a weird taste to that, it really did. It yeah. It's had a funky taste to it, it wasn't nice. This is where it gets interesting because you also said number two Yeah. It's out. It wasn't nasty, but okay. it, they win. Okay. Well, number two. Man. Was high. <laughs> <laughs> and it's all, I've done it all properly. Oh, no, I believe you, I believe you. Uh, yeah. So it a... the winner was three. Was three. And that was Audi. No. Yeah. Just shows you, doesn't it? And now, so your second favourite was Branston. So that, that is mental. That's mad. But isn't that interesting? Well, I, I can tell you right now, it, Audi. It, yeah, tastiest bean. Definitely. The, which is I've got weird. to say, even looking at them, they even look. The, the, you can tell little doesn't look a good bean. No, they're it? really they small. They really. They're not nice at all. Yeah. But the, I mean, the Heinz. I mean, to be fair, the Heinz looks a little. Yeah. Uh, anemic compared to the to, to Aldi and Bram. Bramston looks the colour, most colour uh, one, colourful. Yeah. Um, but Aldi, yeah, hands down, that's mad. Well, there you go. So, <laughs> so next time you're having a fully gizzy, you're going, oh yeah, that's Heinz. Yeah. Well, that's. Uh, I mean, if, if they give me a little, I'll, I'll give it to them back. <laughs> yeah, you have to say next time, do you have Audi beans? <laughs> yeah, I've got Audi beans. Yeah, I'll tell well, you what, I'm very surprised. I mean, as I said, Heinz is, is it was nice, but Aldi's the tastiest bean. That was really, it just had a nice taste. Was, nice. And it, it was a cross between Aldi and Branston. I'm very surprised. But Aldi topped it over Branston, which is... Uh, so, I'll, yeah, that's why... Well, that's my personal favourite, but that, is, that was very interesting. Is it your per personal favourite? Well, don't taste any. Leave it for now. Well, yeah. Well, we have to do another. I like these challenges. They're they're quite good. That was really interesting. <laughs> yeah. But I'm, well, yeah. I'm I'm absolutely gobsmacked. It's uh, yeah. Can't believe I've been wrong all this time. <laughs> hey! <laughs> now that's going to start being gate again. <laughs> yeah, but I, I, I really find that fascinating because I've seen this a lot on, on the TV, and you know, even these top foodie people, they, you know, they try this food and they go, oh yeah. And normally Christmas time, and they compare uh, M&S and Waitrose and stuff, don't they, to Lidl and Aldi? And, yeah. And there you go, proofs in the pudding. Or in the beans, in, in this case. <laughs> so, guys, what do you reckon on that then? Because I, I found it uh, really enjoyable, and to just to see the Audi come on top, and you, you find that in so many different food products that Audi do. That, yeah. I'm really surprised. That, like I say, but the only ones that little was just, uh, yeah, that was yeah. easy to, de to deduct. But yeah, very good, Aldi. Well done, Aldi. There you Crikey. go. <laughs> so, guys, hope you enjoyed this one. Tell us what you think. And, uh, yeah, I enjoyed that, Lee. I did, yeah. Really enjoyed it. Well, Thank you. you. So, for now, it's good uh, goodbye from him. <laughs> and it's a goodbye from him. <laughs> this is Lee, the Mac Master. I'll leave his details in the description. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs> hey! That was really good, I enjoyed that!